I'm not nervous, just cautious. A trait you ought to nurture as well. I know, and I am. Well, I'm about the streets for a time to lose any tales. I've worked in intelligence as long as you have. I need no lessons in spycraft. Two of yous, sod off. But Master Hunter, sir, we're not in no one's ah. way. Unbelievable. A witcher in Novigrad. What will? The plague. Give a small jar of glamour. You blood on your swords! Come through. Fuck. Looking for Gregor. You found him? Who are you? Geralt of Rivia. Dijkstra sent me. Been expecting someone. Let's take a walk. Nice job decorating your guard post. By orders of our gracious and merciful ruler, the good king. What was their crime? One on the right, a Pella from a village nearby. Gave some bloke the wrong advice. Bloke's mates informed on him. Neighbor held a grudge against the one on the left. Accused him of witchcraft. Just humans at each other's throats. That's not Radovid's fault. Hmm. Who do you think set down the laws that mean folk hung for such offences? Let's talk. Must know why I'm here. Take it, it's about our cobbler friend. Yeah, he came through here on his way out. Didn't come back, though. Patrol went out yesterday, reported an abandoned cart a ways off the road. Aim to go out there, see if it's his. Couldn't get away. Thanks. Good enough to start with. Farewell. Hold on. You got a pass? Won't get back through without one. 
Yeah, I got one. All right. Good luck. Thanks. See ya. If a man defies a pact, solemn or not, he'll be devoured. Probably find him hanging for a branch in the woods soon. Not willing to believe that, that's nice. I'm not. I advise you well, dear. Find him hanging for a branch in the woods soon. It passes the least. Can't believe it. Well, second. We might understand it. Not one of the barrels, men, are you? We're all a dry, like this. Yeah. Great right, men lovers, to work! Ah! Ah! Oh, dead! Somewhere, there's got to be. Look from your stall by the bridge across the pond tower. Got goods for the army mostly. I make an exception for you. Run, Roach. Hmm. Cart doesn't look damaged. Strange. Need to look around. Might find something. Ah, uh, that stench. trail. What's he doing here? <laughs> Greetings. Away go with you go. You did pick me. I can see that. Just wondering how those shoes is wound up here. Here yes, you did grow. Like the mushroom. Shoes don't sprout from the ground. You see who left them behind here? Mm. Mm. Speak no rog. Or oh, anger gets og and pog. Og and pog? Those your friends? Finderinger's great og pog. Human 
find her on Big Suited card. Suit is big like so. Mm -hmm. What did they do to this human? Ogpog man's cover to take. They're over. Do you eat him? Nah, no. Body man's, stringy man's, blah. Oggy make man's suited make. Frog, pog and rog suited make. You even need shoes? Shoes is on whom is it? Shoes is once og, pog, and rock. Big lords trollers be. Like whom is it? So long. I'm okay, you must be nearby. I need to... This bugger's an old friend of mine. Bugger friend or go! A wheeze in soup throw! I'd make for an awfully veiny morsel. Right, true that. Just look at the plowing bastard. Naught but skin and bones. Well, gentle trolls, our time I traveled on. You, uh, practice what I taught you. Give you a fucking exam next time I come through. Tell her no go. Tell her shit. Sit us down. Tell her suck cock shoes is big. I can see you've made friends. But Taller needs to come with me. Blood nowhere Taller go. Taller shoes is big. But I need him. Tell us here, stay. You shoes is got. Og shoes is got not. Rug got not. Pug got not. Tell us shoes is make. Tell us go. Now let's all stay calm. Taller will be back. He just needs to come with me. We'll uh, get some leather for your shoes. Ah, ah. Listen to Garrel. He's telling the plowing truth. <laughs> Look at your feet. They're fucking mammoth. Need a damn bale of leather to make shoes for them. Understand? Me and Garrel will get some cocksucking leather. Then I'll come back and make your blasted shoes for you. Shoes is punk for? And rug for? Two pairs for each of you now, pricks. Hmm. Tyler go. But back come must. Knew you buggers were good mates. Sit tight. Be back in a bit. Never thought of having children. Children aren't trolls, and vice versa. Besides, witches are sterile. Ah. Not changed a bit. Still tart as rotten rhubarb.
it's clearing up. Thanks again, Geralt. I'll take it from here. And I'll be sure to tell Roach and Dijkstra how you buggered Og and his mates sideways. As I see it, they'll be so impressed they'll shit themselves. So what'll you do now? What do you mean? Head back to Novigrad. Dijkstra, Roach and I have got a master plan to set in motion. I'll ask again. Details. Forgive me, mate, I plow in corn. See, were it just up to me, I'd spill it loud and proud. You're trustworthy like no one else I know. But I'm not on my own. So, blooming unilateral decisions are out of the question. Trap stays shut, I'm afraid. Right, gotcha. So long, Taller. And good luck. Oh, I can bloody use it. Radovid's one crafty ore with a clap. But we'll figure a way around that twat. Soon the old bloody North will be blathering about how he got fucked. Careful it's not also blathering about three assassins, drawn and quartered. <laughs> Fear not, Geralt. We know what we're doing. Farewell. That's it, Roach. Whoa! Take it easy. What's going on here? Why isn't anyone putting that out? We want it to burn. Got it? Piss off, or we'll fry you along with a fucking elf! There's a third way out of this situation. Time to end. Not good. What was this about? Why'd they want to burn you alive? They came to rob me. I refused to betray where I keep my valuables, so they brought in a cart full of firewood, barred me inside, and set fire to the thing. Probably counting on you being swayed. Though I doubt they would have let you live even if you talked. I've yet to thank you for your aid, Vatgern. My coin lies concealed in a hollowed out stump behind the house. Take what you wish. It's dangerous to possess too much in these times. Thank you. Farewell.
run, Roach. You trouble me, Greylocks. When this is all over, I aim to open the You've been here, you've been Geralt of Rivia. Safe and sound. You play Gwent, Roach? Yes, but there's no one to play against here. If you've got a deck, pull it out. Good luck. Stop by sometime for another round. Best beware of the other side of the river. One false move and you could be royally fucked. Ever heard of preventive arse whooping? <laughs> Need to talk to you. About? Uma, gonna take him with me. Gotta ask the Baron's permission. Thing is, he ain't here. Not about to ask for anything. I'm telling you, you can try to stop me. But that'd be an error. A mortal one. Think you got me shaking in my boots? You sure as hell should be. Fine. Cripple's not worth no blood. See the groom. He ought to be glad to give him up. Bugger's been eating from the feed bags. And a pleasant journey to you both. Thank you kindly. Sergeant Hartle said I could. Bring him back, though, won't you? Be awful dull without him. No. Not about to bring him back. Open the door. Now. Hey, little guy. Here's Roach. She'll take us to Care Morning. Well, come on.
What the? Quit playing around. Let's go. Displeased with you. Then he ought to ask somebody else for help. The Emperor does not ask anyone for anything. You will ride with us to Vitsima. Sure about that? Don't even try. Fine. Lead the way. and the third army will sweep in from the west to take Banglin. If I may, your Imperial Majesty, our spies report that the garrison at Banglin consists almost wholly of mercenaries. Bribery, then. We stand to lose exactly no men in battle. And we stand to lose less time. Very well. Give the orders. Then set sail. As you wish. At once! Your Imperial Majesty, Yennefer. I did not have you brought here for an exchange of courtesies. Report. No courtesies needed? Perfect. But remember, I'm not your soldier, or page, or dog, so don't give me any orders. Would you prefer I order my guards? Look around. I need only Beckham. Geralt. Now report. Siri. Well, this man is the key to finding her. I give you three solid leaves. Trails as fresh as morning dew. The aid of my spies and my court sorcerers. Yet in my daughter's stead, you bring me this... monstrosity? I hope you have more to say. For your sake. Listen, I'm looking for a needle in a haystack. A needle that at any moment can... It's a difficult task, I know this. What of it? Listen to me. I rule the largest empire the world has ever known. I wage a war against the North, command men in tens of thousands, while at home the trade corporations and nobles seek to depose me. You cannot expect me to pity you the difficulty of your task. This monstrosity might well be your daughter. Its body is the product of a curse. Someone hides inside it. Can you lift this curse? I've done a great deal of research made inquiries, but to lift it, I would need to know the words used to cast it, and that... Raphael Ellen, Kedmil Foli, Gladiv Dorn Eptened, Bandro Ithne Iacus. Dandelion told me. Siri talked to him about it. At last, you provide a pleasant surprise. Lady Yennefer, my question stands. Yes. I, I believe I can. But I must... Details do not interest me. Geralt, you've achieved precious little, yet admittedly more than the bumblers in my spy corps have. I give you half the promised reward. You will receive the other when you bring me Siri. Wouldn't count on that happening. That was no request, it was an order, Geralt. And I advise you well. Do not disobey me. This audience is over. 
till the next. So, how do we lift Uma's curse? We must take him to Kaer Morhen. Oh, and Geralt. Forgive me, but I'm unable to teleport you, Uma, and Roach, so... Don't worry. We'll ride there. Never did like teleporting. Take care of yourself. Wait. Here. Probably better if you keep it. Of course. I'm off. His long search for Ciri led Geralt to conclude that Uma, the ugliest man alive and the victim of a curse, was the key to finding the young woman. Geralt needed to lift the curse. So he took Uma to the home of the world's greatest specialist on dark spells. To the Witcher's Fortress of Kaer Morhen. Quite a while. Too long. <laughs> and your journey, how was it? Calm, if you don't count the forked tail that flew over our heads a few miles back. Passenger got a little restless. <laughs> mm. What have we here? Multiple deformities, eyes, ears, nostrils, a hair, lip, and is this... <laughs> now, now, calm down. Jennifer was right on one count. Thing sure isn't pretty. Yen's here already. And how? Huh, you two argue? Geralt, I understand she's a... Well, how do I put this? Emancipated, strong-willed woman. But do manners count for nothing? She teleports in, not even a nice to see you, jumps right into a we've a curse to live, there's this to do and that. So Eskel and Lambert get going. And she went to the guest room to rearrange things through the bed off the balcony. So where is everyone? Eskel's hunting fork tails. Gotta nip that infestation in the bud. And since Yennefer needs to distill some ingredients from their organs, well, like they say, two birds, one stone. Lambert's still in the keep, preparing to venture into the mountains to enrich the phylactery with elemental power. Mm hmm And Yen? Assembling a megascope. Wanted my help running around with some chirping contraption, searching for something. But I'm too old for that nonsense. I should let her know I'm here. If you say so, but don't go thinking she'll throw her arms around your neck.
again. Damn it. to blow us up? Geralt, I'm sorry, but I'm in no mood for jests. What's eating you? Let me think. That was the third crystal to explode. It's been a week, and Lambert's still not done what I've asked. Vesemir spitefully insists on repairing the wall just beneath my window and starts hammering at the crack of dawn, while Eskel seems to have gone mushroom picking, not forktail hunting. The guys. Well, they're not exactly happy with you. Hmm. Why is that? Because you aren't willing to say what you're planning. You're treating them like pages, not including them. Us, actually, because I feel that way too. I shall explain everything when the time is right. First, we must finish our preparations. Fine. What do I do? Firstly, help Eskel and Lambert. One was supposed to get me Forktail spinal fluid, the other was to fortify the phylactery with elemental power. I've yet to see anything from either of them. All right, I'll talk to them. Anything else? Yes. There's one other trifling matter. As you saw, my megascope's acting up in rather spectacular fashion. I'm certain there's an energy source nearby, generating disturbances, making the crystals malfunction. We must find it and neutralize it. Quickly, I must contact someone. It's urgent. All right. How do I find the source? Use this Potesta Quisitor. Potesta... Potesta Quisitor? Sounds fancy. Complicated. Yet it's ever so simple. Grasp it firmly, move it around, and the louder it squeals, the closer you are. Spare me your juvenile wit, please. Well, what are you waiting for? Ah, one more thing. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Geralt. Witchering just never took off. Mounted Witchering just never took off. Yes? What is it, Wolf? No offense, but why all the construction? So the roof tiles don't drop on our heads? Roof tiles usually fall from the roof. You're putting up walls, rebuilding the fortress for three people. Why? Because I remember how it was, Wolf, before the massacre. We were 20, and that's just teachers. As for candidates, I can't turn back the clock, I know. But I refuse to just sit and stare at these ruins. See you later, Vesemir. So... Jennifer found a volunteer to walk around with that chirping. Ah, there you are. To 
disturbance is coming from there. What's in these crates? Dimeridium bombs. Lambert made them. No wonder the megascope doesn't work. All right, gotta get him out of here. I can do that. Rather you not make a mess of my shelves, just keep an eye on Uma. Yes, Uncle Vesemir. How goes it? Vesemir's not working you too hard, I hope. Thought so. All done. You can go. Now, let's check your conditioned reflexes. Thank you. Seems to be working now. What was it? Dimeridium bombs. Lambert left them by the beds. Hmm. I suppose he had no idea they could interfere with my megascope? You know, Lambert's not exactly an expert on megascopes, so... Please. Lambert is mean, not stupid. But no matter. More importantly, I shall finally be able to contact Ida. The Ida? Elvin Sage? What do you want from her? Stay and you'll learn for yourself. Members of the Lodge don't let just anyone in on their secrets, or so I've heard. Consider it a token of our trust. Now let's begin. And Geralt, behave, please. Didn't you just say you trust me? Stop twisting my words. Cadnell Yennefer at Vengerberg. Gwynblade? Cadmill and Severn. Why have you summoned me? We've come up against a curse. One we must lift. It was uttered in a dialect of elder speech unfamiliar to me. I see. The words of the curse? Vafel Elaine, Kedmil Foli, Gledev Don Eptenid, Bondro Isne Iacus. Take it you've heard the words before. Yes. In legends, of the kind that do not end happily. Can you help us with the curse? To a degree, Agnes de Glanville's incantation, combined with Elder's Triangle, inverted, of course. They are your only possible recourse. But I cannot guarantee that even they will suffice. Thank you, Ensevern. Vafel. That does not conclude our conversation. What is it? The time of the white frost and white light is nigh. And the world will perish amidst ice. I know Ithleen's prophecy. I don't doubt you know it. But do you understand it? The Elder Blood can initiate the final age, the time of the end. Or stop it. Remember this, Gwynblade, for you will be the one to determine if the seed bursts into flames. All in all, interesting conversation. What now? Finish whatever it was you and the boys were planning to do. Then we'll begin.
What's this? Brewing potions? No. Booze from potato peels. Hmm. For my welcome back feast? Actually, more like my farewell feast. Haven't heard? Madame Sorceress has requested I fortify the phylactery with power from the Circle of Elements. Says it's essential to lifting the curse from that monstrosity of yours. Realize that monstrosity, as you put it, might be Siri? Yeah, I heard. Mind showing a bit of sympathy? I call him like I see him. That's how I am. Irritating, you mean? I thought you liked people with bitchy streaks. So long as they're women. Then you found the best of them. Enough about that. The Circle of Elements awaits. Don't sound too thrilled about all this. I'm not. You know the trek to the Circle's no walk in the park. In more ways than one. Let me go with you. Well, might have more spring in my step with the famous white wolf at my side. So, you ready? No reason to wait. Let's go. Oh, I meant to tell you. Can't get to the Circle through the mountains. Rockslide blocked the pass last spring. So we approach from the pond side, like when we did the trial of the medallion? Exactly. Remember the way? Not easily forgotten that. He who returns with his medallion will prove himself worthy and may set off on the path. Does Amir ever hear you impersonate him? <laughs> yeah. Old man can't stand it. Sabola's Breach. Still haven't patched it up? Vesemir'd like to. Doesn't bother me, though. Not expecting anyone to lay siege, and... This way I got a shortcut to the pond. Shame those salamander assassins didn't punch a few more holes in our walls. Or finish the job and reduce these ruins to rubble. Been thinking. We gonna swim across the pond? No, I got a boat moored there. You know, for fishing. Wow. Never took you for the fishing type. I use bombs. I drop them in, then scoop up whatever floats to the surface. <laughs> that makes sense.
me impressed. Where'd you learn them tricks? It's an art. Learned it from this old master down in Zaracania. Yeah. Save that tale for your next sorceress. Tell me about Vesemir. Things any better between you? Seems so. Old man's dropped the moralizing, and I try not to piss him off too often. Mm -hmm. Working out well? Moderately. Castle's pretty big. Easy to stay out of each other's way. Damn it! I moored it right here, I swear! Line must have come loose. Really? Here I thought the boat untied itself to go for a jaunt on its own. Damn it. In this fog, we'll never... There a storm before I arrived? Let me think. Yeah, five days passed. Mm. Wind must have grabbed the sail, tugged the boat off its mooring. Boat drifted into the bushes. Thing we need. Cave entrance is just opposite, see it? Gotta sail across the pond, go through the cave, climb Troll's head, and we're there. Doesn't seem like such an ordeal now, does it? No. Still gives me the shivers, though. You know only two boys returned from my group? You were the ones who ran into old Speartip in the caverns, right? Mm-hmm. Let's go. Jump in the boat. All right. I'm taking the tiller, though. Because? Because it's my boat, not up for discussion. Yourself? Yeah. Something you don't like about it? Besides the water up to our ankles? Nothing. Quit whining. It'll make it across the lake. Provided we don't smash into something first. I barely see the tip of my nose. Fog's thick as curdled milk. Never took you for a poet. Oh, but I am one. Wanna hear a limerick? Sure. Lambert, Lambert, what a prick. Not bad.
fall off a bit. Sails fluttering. Don't teach your grandma to suck eggs. Right, almost there. Ready for the caverns? Almost. Before we go inside... Ugh, drink a dose of cat, I know. Any more words of wisdom? Like, step softly or you'll wake old spear tip? Sheesh, you're pricklier than Yen. Ugh, don't fall in love with me. Let's go. Ah! Help! Hear that? Sounds like a kid. You know this valley's uninhabited except for us. It's gotta be an illusion. What if it's not? <sighs> Whatever you want to do. You're probably right. Let's go, straight to the cave. Finally, something reasonable. Not if I give you a boost. Remember? Part of the trials. A witcher is a lone hunter. But even a lone hunter can use a helping hand sometimes. Vesemir. Ready? Oh! You fat fuck! One, two, three! You're no feather either. Come on, let's go. Wall looks a little shaky. Hard, maybe? Mind not stomping like that. Relax. I slipped. Oh! What? Something fell in my eye. Splinter, I think. Hope it wasn't from a broken mirror. That'd make you even nastier. Ha ha. Ah, so soft and sweet to sleep in there. Makes you want to make this moment last forever. Just lost the element of surprise. I couldn't care less. I'm up for the challenge. Probably. Let's get out of here. Wait. That's for Voltaire, you whore son. <laughs> Voltaire. Who's that? Don't remember? Little guy. A scar on his chin, right here. Oh, yeah, I remember. All we can do now. Never made it out of here. Let's go.
Oh, good to be back above ground. Mm-hmm. Still trouble ahead. You mean the trolls? They're in for trouble, not us. We ought to be careful. This is their turf. Couple of trolls got you soiling your knickers? Was bold and brash once, like you. Then I took a pitchfork in the gut. Peasant kid, not a troll. I almost died. Hard way to learn, but I did. Come on. See him shit and run soon as he saw us? Mm hmm Never known a troll to do that. Just is to walk no more. The stops? Yeah. East Mountain. Trolley Mountain. Trolley Mountain. Huh? Oh. Hi! Uh, hey! This Troll Mountain. Uh, you talk to these idiots. Stay calm. We just want to get to the circle. Which is this thing one say? Thing two do. Thing three do. Sometime. Ah, uh, enough! Out of my way, dimwits, or I'll grind you to gravel. Understand? <laughs> mm-hmm, they understood all right. Congrats. Run for the cave! Before they stone us to death! Far more! Which is this? Understanding? We understand it, but we still gotta get to the Circle of Elements. 